All right, so I I haven't dealt with too much of his bullshit. I mean, he claims that he forgot who I am mm -hmm. a little while ago. I'm like, oh, no, I'm not somebody you forget. And then I think it was the day you actually reported where you told me that he went and said he was going to go motorboat you. Yep. I, I got on his case like it was nobody's business, in my opinion. I was pissed. Yeah, I was so happy when I saw you do that. Like, seriously, thank you. You are more than welcome. I mean, if he does anything like that again, I want to be, like, one of the first three people to know. In fact, I want to be the second person to know you being the first. <laughs> nice. Because I... I cannot stand that. Worth, I, I just cannot. I... I I hate it when people disrespect women, but for somebody I'm willing to consider a very close friend, I guess I consider you a close friend. I would send Aww. you Christmas cards and hoo-ha. I'd invite you over for parties and whatnot if possible, but yeah, close friend. That's when it gets me pissed off, because, I mean, I really didn't want to make a video, but seeing that he's harassing you like this and harassing other people I'm willing to consider friends like this... I'm willing to make another hate video if people are willing to bash on me about it and dislike me and try to get me off of YouTube, then I guess that's okay. Because I'm doing what I think is right. I'm standing up for you and I'm standing up for everybody else he takes off and treats badly. But, so, this is just from tonight alone. Um... Uh, out of respect for a couple of the YouTubers, because I do not have their permission to expose their names, I will be crossing their names out. But its he's a guy who recently subbed to me. He subbed to you two recently. Mm -hmm. And he's just like, yeah, he battled, he's going to upload the video where he beat me because this guy was using a mono dark type team because he was testing it out. And, and he lost. And that's fine if you lost. You're testing out a team. But of course, Lofting Styles is only going to upload it because he only uploads battles where he wins. Yep. I think he only has like one or two where he actually loses. Except the one I uploaded. Ha <laughs> ha. So he says here, yeah, he's going to be uploading a video. I got beat. Stupid fighting types. And now Lofting Styles is sitting here saying, oh, you're just twisting my words around in a big smiley face. And, you know, I, I tell this uh, anonymous YouTuber and subscriber that he only uploads the battles that he wins, like I said. And anonymous YouTuber says, yeah, it's he's not used to battling people who switch out a lot, which happens a lot in singles. Yep. It happens. So, he did have a bit of a disadvantage there. <laughs> I'm, <coughs> I'm sorry for coughing. I'm still getting over some ew. <laughs> and... And Lofting Styles is, sits here, and he, then he starts calling me out. And he's just like, your sentence is ironic. Do you even watch my videos? You're an idiot. I'm sick and tired of you misunderstanding and saying my videos are crap. Watch my videos before you start starting bullshit. Mm, crap. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, no, I've seen your videos. You can find my comments. I've just liked all of the, his videos. Oh, I have too. And then he tells the anonymous uh, YouTuber that it's called competitive battling. I'm like, okay, I can't get on Lofting Styles' case too much for that, but the way he said it kind of gets under my skin. But I call it Lofting Styles and say, I've seen your battles in quotations. You only upload, you only upload like maybe one, two battles where you lost. I'll upload the other battles and maybe I'll start to believe you. And then he says, eh, I got nothing to prove to you. And this is when I really called him out and put him in his place oh. this time around. Oh, do it. Please do it. It's because you have nothing to show. You talk a big game, but you're still just a little kid who wants to play the big leagues with the grown-ups. <laughs> burn. There aren't enough uh, burn heels in the entire region to cure him of that. Oh, there aren't enough entire... Like, there aren't enough burn heels for, to... Just, all the burns he suffered. He suffered more than the ones you've dealt tonight. There are so many more, it's not even funny. And then here's his, his reply. Dude, I've been swimming with sharks since 2011, and three years later, I'm already a competitive battler, so don't bring up that grown-up in quotations bullcrap. I also think it's safe to say a 14-year-old can outsmart a 23-year-old predicting-wise. LOL. Back off, dude. Uh, 
competitive battler, my ass. If he wants to call himself a good competitive battler, then I'm fucking Arceus, okay? I'm the world champion, then. Seriously. I'm world champion, then. Seriously. Get and then the he says, not to brag it and all, but I'm in the big leagues. Oh, really? Where's your invitation to Worlds? Where's your invitation to any real competition? Nowhere. Just like that invitation yeah. to be an ambassador. More like an ambassador. Mm-hmm. Thank you, Newsies, for giving me that line. <laughs> okay, and then I say, ha-ha, now that's the funniest thing I've ever heard. Catch up to the real players, then we'll talk. And I'm going to cross out the entire response from uh, this anonymous YouTuber because it doesn't have too much to do with the current situation. And then he says, question mark first. So here's the improper English, which he is famous for. Yep. You're so fucked up in the head, dude. And yeah, it may seem a little ironic to say that, but it's true. You're a good player, but you suck competitive lot wise. Me, on the other hand, is only good at predictions, which in my case makes me win battles. Just because you beat me countless times doesn't make you a better battler than me. Learn that, noob. Seriously. No. Just no. Okay? And if I remember correctly, I thought you beat him more times than he beat you. We battled four times, he beat me twice, and I beat him twice. Okay, so then if he wants to base it off of his logic, then you're both at an equal level. Yes. Now, if he hadn't used his uh, jetting team and hadn't lied about what team he was using, yeah, it would have been all victories for me. Just saying. Ugh. I'm not saying I'm a great battler, but from my one video I've uploaded, you can already tell I'm a better player than him. Yeah, no, seriously. He doesn't even know what a fucking physical attacker is between a special attacker. Okay? Del Fox. Not a physical attacker. Sharpedo, not a special attacker. Okay, Needle King, not a good physical attacker. And my 3DS is dying. So I have to Don't die on me, 3DS. To grab that before that happens. But, like... Alright, so I reply to that and I say, I beat you over and over and I'm the bad player? If you're a hot shot, do rated battles now, because he's currently doing the free battles to sit, prove that he's a good player. No. Yeah. No. And he's like, you really misunderstood me. LOL. First off, I never had it said you sucked. Read my last message, and I don't think I got the rest of the thing, but uh, all it really says... He said you sucked more times than he can't even fucking remember, okay? Yeah. And then I'm just going to cross out the anonymous YouTube comment from Mr. Anonymous because he just wants to... He's asking me for for help with this team, which I wouldn't to consider a great compliment, because I'm more of a Pokemon philosopher than a battler, which is why I always like talking with you, because you're a battler and all that fun hoo-ha. <laughs> and so I ask him who's on his team, and we're just going to skip that. And so Lofting Style says, Ugh, I'm out, I already know Kyle. So here, he proves he knows who I am. He knows who I am, and he just admits it here. I'm out. I already know Kyle called that peasant rotten. He just calls somebody who was willing to defend him a peasant rotten. Oh, yeah. I just... Guys, don't, don't be friends with this guy. I mean, I tried to be nice to him. He treated me like shit. Another guy's willing to give him a shot. Treating him like shit. He treats everybody who tries to be nice to him like shit. Yeah, he recently got kicked out of a bunch of Google Plus groups because they saw all of his bad behavior, and they also reported his own bad behavior within the group. Seriously. Oh, my fucking God. Also, I sent you a link to the video where, you know, he started picking on me again. So... Oh, I, yeah, I'll, I'll, look, I'll look for... I'll watch the video, and then... I guess this is where my... I'm willing to say I may have sounded a little arrogant in this comment, but I just say, Lofting Styles, I am the better player. Because he's sitting here talking about how he's some supreme, awesome player. I'm like, I'm willing to say I'm the better player. No, that's not arrogant. That's just truth. Anyone's a better player than him. Okay? And it has nothing to do with skill in this case. It's just that you have better manners. Okay? It's all that it is. 
because you don't DC on people. If you have, it's most likely by accident. In fact, it's I just, don't disconnect. I don't forfeit. I take it like a man. I'm like, okay, I'm going to lose. I may as well take the loss because I know what I'm getting myself into if somebody challenges me. Yep. Just, if you do that, everyone has respect for that. Even if they aren't a good quotation marks player, they still think that they are a great player because of their respect for the player and for the meta. Lofting Styles does not have the, the respect, the skill, or any kind of positive denotation that would make him a supposed competitive battler. He's not competitive. He's not. Ever. He's never going to be a competitive battler. And he should just get the fuck out of the scene before somebody eats him alive. Well, here, here's his comeback to what you just said. And it wasn't even directed at you, but it was directed at me. So here's his comparison between me and him. I'll just give you an example as to why I'm the better player. I use unique and special sets and Pokemon. No, you don't. He asked me to bring him a Grabble because somebody else was using it. He wanted me to clone, wanted my friend to clone his team for him. That's, that's not original. He stole Demonix Florges. I think it's either, it, yeah, I'm pretty sure it was Demonix Florges. So, yeah, no, you're not, you're not special. You're not creative. He said before, he said that Whirlwind is not a common move on Skarmory. Are you fucking retarded? Are you fucking retarded? Because I think you are. I think we all know you're retarded at this point. And not to mention, we had, uh, what's his face? We didn't exactly like him much either because he said a bunch of shit to Verlucify. But we kind of accepted that. But we sent him over to battle Lofting Styles. And you know how he beat Lofting Styles? He taunted the Skarmory because he wasn't running any attacking move on it. Okay? You can probably get away with that in doubles, but in singles? No, you can't. Because taunt exists. You got shut down be by your own Skarmory. Way to go. You See, I actually like to use his team whenever I have a new team, cause, and I want to test it out before I do the... Uh battle test area and go online do all that stuff because I'm like, I mean, you know what? I'll fight a little kid's team and see how that works and just work my way up. See what adjustments I need to make. Yeah, if you can't, sur if your team can't survive his shitty team, then you need to go back to the drawing board. Cause his yeah, and team then here's, uh. yeah, and here's what he says about my playing. What makes you a noob and the loser is you use Suicune all the time. No, I don't. I've only seen you use it in, like, one or two battles. Max. I, I've used it in a few battles because it was a good staple in my team. I'm actually weeding off of that team at the moment. I'm building a, lo a few other teams. And besides, I thought Pokemon was a game to have fun, not to determine who the better player is. Smash my head. Oh, no, no. See, if he wants to get on that shit, what, is this, what do 90% of his videos have in it? A fucking Skarmory. Shut the hell up. Seriously. You don't Scar need to movie. go there. Galvantula. And he even said getting ready for rated battles, which determines who the better player is. Who makes the better predictions? Who has the better luck? You know why he won't do rating? Because he can't break a 1300 rating. I can guarantee you he can't fucking break a 1300 rating. Yeah, and then he says, anyways, I'm out. I don't want to get wrecked. R-E-K-T by a girl dot L-O-L. Uh, you already did several times, and it wasn't even by me. You have other girls who constantly wreck you just because they're fucking smarter than you. Hell, I know five-year-olds who are smarter than you. Get wrecked.